Hi everyone, Michelle here from the Photo Editing and DigiScrap Academy. In today's short Sunday snippet, I'll talk to you about masking. There's only a couple steps you need to take to create a beautiful layout. And I think that you are going to become a lot less anxious when we talk about digital masking because there's only like three or four steps, maybe even just two or three. So stay tuned. And also we are using Photoshop Elements. I happen to be using, I believe in this one, it's 2021, version 2021, but this will work in earlier versions and later versions if you're watching this at a later date. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next Sunday. Bye for now. Have any of you heard of masking? Say yes or no, masking in the digital world. A lot of no's, a couple yeses. So masking is another way of creating a really cool page. So I'm gonna bring up a piece of paper just like you would the traditional way. And this one is a digital paper, of course. So I'm gonna show you how quickly you can mask to make your page look beautiful. So I'm gonna go file and place. I'm going to go get a mask, place a picture on top of this mask, and then clip it in there. So let's go to image, actually file, place, and I can get a photo. Let's go back to the photo. This one here is really cute. And then I'm going to go ahead and mask it into that. I'm going to clip it. So I'm going to right click and create clipping mask. So does it, did that make sense to you all? So basically what it did was it took the photo and it masked it into that black and white. Awesome. Isn't it cool? And it's really, really easy. It's really, really easy because you just take all those masks and then you just right click and clip it in there. Now, if you didn't like this photo in there, I can go ahead and delete that photo and I can bring in another one. So let's just try that. Let's go file and place. And let's just bring in this one. And the same difference. I go ahead and select it, right click on the layer itself and choose create clipping mask. And I can move it to wherever it needs to be. And I can rotate it if I don't like the way the photo is laying and it clips right into that. Now we go into a lot of like, if people are really interested in masking, we have five or six different classes inside of the membership area for masking only. But I just wanted to give you a little overview of what masking is all about.